The following BLTV program is brought to you by O'Flaherty Law. Please enjoy. Welcome to Learn About Law. My name is Kevin O'Flaherty from O'Flaherty Law, and today we're going to answer the question, what is a series LLC? So first, let's talk about what an LLC is in the first place. An LLC is a corporate form that allows one or multiple people to operate a business together like a partnership, but unlike a partnership, it protects the members of the LLC, those are the owners of the LLC, uh, from li personal liability for corporate debt. There's also some tax advantages to incorporating as an LLC as opposed to just operating as a partnership. Um, LLCs are great if you've got one business operation. But what if you have multiple business operations, uh, like multiple pieces of real estate that you manage, and you want to segregate them from each other in terms of both liability or maybe keeping a separate set of books, or maybe there's even a slightly different ownership group? Well, Series LLC is a cost-effective way to solve these problems. If you have multiple business operations that you want to keep separate from each other, you've got really two options. One is to have multiple LLCs, so each one could have its own LLC. LLC. The other is to have one series LLC, and each of these is a different cell within the series LLC. So if your series LLC is named O'Flaherty Law, that might be the mothership LLC, and then each entity, each piece of real estate O'Flaherty Law owns, or each different uh, business operation within O'Flaherty Law will be called O'Flaherty Law 1, O'Flaherty Law 2, O'Flaherty Law 3. Each one is a different cell. And O'Flaherty Law 1 will not be liable for the debts of O'Flaherty Law 2. And O'Flaherty Law 2 won't be liable for the debts of O'Flaherty Law 3. So you are able to basically segregate within one company uh, liability. And you can, each one can have a separate set of books. Um, and again, each cell within the LLC can have a different ownership group. Now, why is this helpful? The main reason is that it's a more efficient way to do things from a Secretary of State fee and attorney fee perspective. So you only have to file one annual report with a series LLC, no matter how many cells there are. So on a just simply Secretary of State fee uh, basis, based on Illinois, uh, the it's basically a wash if you have uh, two business operations. If you have exactly two business operations, on Secretary of State fees, it's pretty close because it costs a little bit more to file a series LLC annual report and to start up a series LLC than it does a regular L LLC. But when you factor in attorney's fees for pre preparing annual reports and preparing operating agreements, that's when you start to save money when you've got two operations. Once you've got three, it's a no-brainer and you're saving money by doing a series LLC. And again, that's because you're only filing one annual report. You're only doing all the corporate setup one time with the Secretary of State. And the other thing is that you only really need one operating agreement. Now, this is different if you've got completely different ownership and different rules of engagement between the different cells of the LLC. But you can just have the mothership LLC, the main primary O'Flaherty Law basic LLC, be the only one with an operating agreement. And each cell, O'Flaherty Law 1, O'Flaherty Law 2, O'Flaherty Law 3, abides by that operating agreement. So this, rather than paying an attorney to draft two operating agreements or three operating agreements, you're only paying to have one done. Rather than paying uh, an attorney to file two or three annual reports, you're paying to have one filed. Now, it's again, that one annual report is slightly more expensive than one annual report from a traditional LLC. But as you put it together, it becomes a cost saving, both from a Secretary of State cost and attorney cost perspective. And again, the, the cost save, savings are greater the more cells you have in your LLC because really the filing, doing all of these this legal work and the filing of these legal documents becomes a fixed cost no matter how many business operations you have going on with a series LLC as opposed to with traditional LLCs. If you, each LLC is going to be an additional, an, an additional cost both in attorney's fees and Secretary of State fees. So people use this a lot in either franchises. You know, if you're open, opening up multiple locations of a franchise, you might use a series LLC for each. Uh, each location will be a, uh, a different cell within the LLC. Or they, they'll use it a lot for real estate investment, and each property will be held by a different L cell within the LLC. And when you do this, it simplifies the process, too, because you don't have to set up an entirely new company each time you have a new investment. So if you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments section below this post at learn-about-law.com or below the video on our YouTube station. If you need some help setting up a series LLC or with anything else, 
give us a call at 630-324-6666. The 630-324-6666. We offer free consultations in many areas of law, and we have offices all around Chicago land for your convenience. If you found this helpful, please subscribe to us on YouTube, iTunes, and SoundCloud. You can also subscribe on our uh, to our email list, and you'll be notified of our daily article and video posts. You can subscribe to our email list at learn-about-law.com, and that also includes links, links to all of those other mediums. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Thanks so much for watching our video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. Click the subscribe button for new videos every week, and download and review us on iTunes. Visit learn-about-law.com for other legal-related articles and videos. Visit our business podcast and video blog, seizeyourbusiness.com. And visit Making Real Estate Fun for real estate videos and podcasts. Call us at 630-324-6666 for a free consultation.